meat. Oh, I'm so exhausted. Dude, like, this morning, the wind was fucking crazy that knocked out my power, dude. That was not fun. Hashtag Team Soul. That wasn't all that bad, honestly. I'm just really happy I wasn't really doing anything on my computer when it happened. Which I'm really happy about. Whoa. Anyways, we're gonna do some World War II stuff, try to get the server seated, all that other stuff. There's a little, little attention going on, so. Need to keep the momentum up. Can't let that fail. But yeah, how's everyone doing? Oh, everyone's having a good day. Hopefully everyone's uh, more awake than I am. Smile. Anyways, let's go ahead and see how everyone's been doing on the server while I've been uh, working on a bunch of other stuff. Let's see what we got going on here. Let's see how far people have made it. Oh, wow. They didn't really make it that far as far as I was uh, expecting, <clears throat> which is actually not bad. We'll use Grand. We'll use Grand as a stomp off point. We'll get that kind of more set up. Uh, I don't know if um, <clears throat> Operation Overlord has fixed the uh, arsenal issue. I hope they uh, fixed it, but we're going to go and see. Oh, enemies. Wait, what do you mean enemies are in the area? Oh, I need to check this because I need to see my QRF stuff. Ah, uh, okay. They're not. So... Even tying these guys in to the point um, didn't work. So I'm going to need to <clears throat> do something to try to make this happen. So that's going to be a little bit of an issue. <clears throat> It's also something I just kind of wanted to see real fast to see if that's a possibility. Um, seems like other than that, everything seems fine. Just some of these other points, though. Like these guys over here. Um, they shouldn't be around. Hold on, we got to teleport over here real fast. I'm going to make sure uh, I can get rid of these guys. So I'm going to have to relook at my QRF uh, script. Okay, yeah, they're dead. To make sure uh, everything's all good there. Shut, brother. What's up? What's up? Not much. Yeah, because it took a long time to actually get eyes on to see if that something like that is going to happen. I should have muted this time. I forgot. Whoops. Ah, that's so funny. Um. So yeah, I'm gonna have to take a relook at the QRF thing. So unfortunately, I had a fear. That uh, that was the case. Um, okay, good. That's an arsenal that they placed down. So we're gonna check this out real fast before we really start getting to playing. Um, make sure these Germans are dead. Are they dead? I think they're dead. Let's see if they at least like put medical in here. Nope. So yeah, I'm gonna have to hound on them. A little bit be like hey like you guys are getting a lot of attention right now and you y'all need to like really fix that arsenal stuff we don't have a vehicle facility here oh no all right there we go do we have a listening post here Someone tried building a living quarters right here. Funny. But I'm not seeing a uh, a radio. So we'll put that on like this field or something. All 
All right, we got some stuff to build around here. How you doing, Captain John? Major John? Good. So behind that building with the red roof, there's uh, living quarters. We can get that built. The red roof inn? Ah, yes, red roof inn. One of the best uh, motels. One time I went to a red roof inn near my sister's place, and the floors were wet. Like, all the floors, even in your room? Yeah. It was like, well, it was like they did steam cleaning, but they only put down the steam, and they didn't actually, like, use the part that sucks up the grime and stuff. That's funny. Yeah, well... So it, it was wasn't. all disgusting. Yeah. Like, even if you wore socks, it, like, you would still, they would still get moist. It was pretty gross. That is pretty gross. Not gonna lie. I might have to redo my QRF system. Because I was really hoping after a restart of tying in all the QRF forces to the point where it would do its checks would uh, disable them, but it didn't. So mm. that idea is gone. I'm not going to be on too long tonight. I got an early morning meeting tomorrow. So. Yeah. I just recently woke up too. I'm like really, uh, really kind of out of it. I was doing a lot of work yesterday. Hardly, uh, working hardly or hardly working? Ha ha ha, so funny, ha ha. You're a funny guy, John. You're a funny guy. Some would say even you're a fun guy. Like, uh, mushrooms. Yeah, like mushrooms, yes. Yes, like mushrooms. I might have to play, like, German units. Kind of off to the side. I wonder if I can run like a script or something in the background. <clears throat> hey, uh, let's see. Does this spawn with uh, ammo boxes in it? No. Go and pull this up to the uh, arsenal. We'll get this thing uh, loaded up. Dude, portabellas. My favorite mushroom. Absolutely. Dude, one of my brothers absolutely hates mushrooms to death. And I'm like, bro, why? Mushrooms are great. Mushrooms are absolutely fantastic. Oh my god, he threw a smoke grenade. Six boxes, them two. How do I lay down? Let's put in some M1 clips in there. Alright, looking. 11 clips, we're gonna need more. Don't gonna need more clips! M1 carbine makes. Yep. All right, trunk's almost full. Then we can put it all in the cargo. Let's see, 1919 ammo. I'm sure someone's gonna be in our, oh, we're low on supplies now. <clears throat> Three extra boxes should be fine for now. That's enough ammo in there. <clears throat> Until we get uh, more supplies. Yonder over here. You know, you know what they need? They need like a fucking fast travel system like the Din Liberation. Then again, I know this is more made for PvE and that would be kind of funny. I think, um... It is that time. Uh, this is not the same, but I think uh, Titty said that they are working on rifle grenades for the Garand. Cool. What the fuck? Yes. It was uh, gunshots. Oh, that's a push. <clears throat> Oh no, it's dead Germans. From the bad QRF force. 
Are, are they broken? Oh yeah, like, what's, shit. What's There's a squad element on the west. Yeah, my original plan for the uh, QRF didn't really go to plan. No. So There's I might have to... Off, off to the north a little bit more from that. I can't wait till they get the uh, ping sound in, the animations. I'm really looking forward to that update. I know that's a... Uh, Gonna be a while. That's gonna be kind of nice. All right, there's more. Oh, there he is. Oh my god! Help! What the heck? What'd you do? The gun, and now I'm getting two frames per second. Help! Help! Kill me, please! Oh god! Ah! Uh. <laughs> What'd you try doing? Just getting in and getting out? Well, I, I was trying to get the gun and I tried to turn, but you can barely turn it. So I went to get out and get in the driver's seat and it just put me in the, the like, rig. Because it, it just had me, like, flipping out, like, spazzing back and forth. Oh, God. We got one German in that field that's, uh, injured. He's like in the smoke, and you can see him laying down, bleeding out. Shit. No, those guys are dead. I still hear fire coming from. Ooh. Yeah, I, I still hear it too. But we also got a friendly. Uh, Friendly to the left at that corner of the barn. Mm -hmm. Where I'm firing, so I, he might be dead. Yeah. I'm gonna get on the other side so I can see better. Yeah, I think it's just all bodies now. Yeah, he's checking. Uh, hold fire. Yeah, I'm out. Yeah, that guy's dead. I don't, I don't have a radio, so I can't say good work, private. Here, I'll let him know. Uh, major says uh, good work there, private. We should put on the major helmet, huh? Probably put on the major helmet. <laughs> He's jumping up and down. Hey, there's one German still breathing out there. He's that breathing? Like an issue solved by yeah. Six. That sounds like an issue that can be resolved by digging a trench, uh, your own pillbox. Your own pillbox? You are about to say your own grave, weren't you? No, I was gonna say no, your own trench. You but... pillbox. Okay. Hey, shit, up the road.
The one laying to his left is still alive. Reloading. I we should probably put ammo, ammo for this in here as well. Yeah, there is. There's two more boxes. Two more boxes? I wonder if it's grabbing it from the cargo, not the trunk. Oh, yeah. I st uh, you got five boxes yeah. in total. There's none in the in the cargo. I, I put there's They're five. In the trunk, I mean. Oh, is it pulling it from the trunk? Well, there is none in the trunk. Now there is. All right, you got two in the cargo and three in the trunk. Here, I'm gonna pull you up. an event today so i had to wear a monkey suit a monkey suit why'd you have to wear a monkey yeah, I suit to wear a full suit you know i, I mean uh it, like a full suit hey yeah there he is and it was like is that friendly off to our 300 300 uh yeah i think that's like friendly it. right there yeah yeah that's the private but it was also like 83 degrees outside Jesus Lord, why did you volunteer to wear the monkey suit? It, well, I don't mean like an actual monkey suit. I mean, like I had a sports jacket. And no, no, you're you're definitely wearing a monkey suit. A fuzzy monkey suit. I oh, looks like there's more contacts up there. Reloading. You might need to pull off on that side road because I don't see the contacts. I see them. They're uh, three, two, five by some uh, boulders and shit. See those two rocks over there? A little bit more to the right? Yeah, like right there. A little lower. A little lower. There you go. They're hitting it. There you go. Yeah, I saw them stand up. I saw some more movement more to the northwest. Or, uh, yeah, more west by the trees I'm looking I'm not really seeing anything hey the uh, gun truck is gonna sit up here at the bridge until uh, we know for sure that all contacts are eliminated God got killed we lost our private that's so sad we lost God I think I avenged him yeah, that guy's dead. Back up a little bit. Alright. I think we're good. Uh, I'm not seeing anything. Here, let me see if I can climb up on top. So I can stand on top of the canopy. Ah, there we go. Yeah, good kill. Yes. It's just phobia. Yeah, it was me. <laughs> His I'm name sorry, is I'm not as fit as I used to be. Private addict. Hey, guy standing Private up next to that uh, light pole. Power pole. Yeah, he's dead. <clears throat> yeah, you got him. One more for good match. I think he's going back to get his gear. Because we are kind of low in supplies on that point. Baron 23. 
Oh shit. Alright, we're looking clear for now. Alright, we're gonna proceed up to the quarry. What those Xbox players get on? Hopefully I didn't like ruin the mood by uh updating the title. What did you update the title to? Uh World War Two PvE conflict. North America. Hold on, because this isn't reloading. We have... Do you have ammo? Yeah, we do. It's not in the trunk. There. Two boxes in the trunk now. Now you should be able to reload it. Oh, what? Okay, so it was in the cargo. It needs to be in the trunk. Yeah. Yeah. I hope he's bringing that truck back with him. Hopefully. The ammo out of it real quick. I don't think you put any ammo in it. I think you just drove it out. Well, we'll just take the ammo that's in it right now. There is no ammo. There's just two bandages. Oh. Good work, Private. Good work, brother. We're gonna start moving up to the quarry. Does the MG on this thing take the uh, 100 round belts? Yeah. Uh, it's the 100 one, uh, round, uh, fucking 50 cal 12.7. M33 ball M10 tracer. Does anyone need any more ammo before, uh, we push off? I know Actually, we got we some in we, here. I mean, I think it would be good to have more ammo for the 50. Yeah, well, we get this loaded up. Uh, guy, go ahead and bring that back. We'll load that one up as well with the 50. Oops, he bonked the bridge. Be okay. Looks okay. I don't know. He's not is moving. He smoking or is that the, just the fire? I, I don't know if it's the exhaust or. Did he just? I don't think he so. Just hit the bridge and then stop <laughs> moving. Did he knock himself out? I, I I don't know. Unless he got himself stuck in a wedge. Oh, there me. he goes. There he goes. What a funny right, Uber. Thank God. It seems like the sort of thing I would do. Yeah, so I renamed the other server to North America Modern Warfare. Right side. Yeah, be fucking kidding me. Yeah, right in the fucking yeah, right there. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. We're good. We're in a better spot now. There we go. So, I mean, if you got any grenades, just fucking uh. Throw him in there. I'm gonna push him out. They're in the creek. Battle up a level on creek. Hey, they're in the town. Yeah, yeah, they're in the town. They're in the houses. They're in here, I'll take point. Got one. Going upstairs. I wonder if the map uh, flashes. Yeah, it does. I did see a setting uh, when I was like kind of messing around with stuff. And I wonder if, uh, it says, like, notification, but it didn't give a description. I wonder if I click that on, if it'll, like, warn people, like, hey, Germans are taking this point. You know, something like that. I'm hearing more in the, uh, creek bed area.
Haha, <laughs> haha, ha, ha. you don't have semi-automatic, you have bolt action. Haha, ha. this is why America won World War II, you guys suck. Alright, I think the creek is cleared. So yeah, I'm, that's gonna be one thing I'm gonna need to be doing is uh, fixing the QRF stuff. I might just mm, probably do something like put it at a two hour, but the thing is like trying to do a battle line kind of thing, or as the lines shift, like QRF will be unavailable for the Germans. Okay, Cause like the other way to do it would be to place them out in the woods and then put them on patrol. But then it doesn't make sense. If the battle line moves they're when it's in a patrol like 20 miles behind enemy lines, unless you know, they've got paratroopers and shit, but you know, hey, smile. Raj. Got contacts in the west. Western fields. But he really needs to fix the uh, AI protectors, though. That, that really needs to be something that they do because, dear lord, it's a... Uh, that would actually really help with like these QRF things as things move forward and things get kind of more built up. Let me see uh, what's going on here, where these guys come from. Why is there all these groups? Where do they fuck do they come from? It might have been my patrols out in uh, the area. That's kind of wild though. That's really wild. I'm definitely going to need to fix a lot of that stuff. Mainly the QRF idea. I was really hoping since, like, if the objective gets, like, moved over, it should stop the spawners and stuff, but it looks like that idea didn't work at all. Definitely makes things more intense, but not my intention at all. So I'm gonna have to go back to the drawing board. I wonder if there's a. Mm, I wonder if I can actually find a way to get someone to make a script or something like that to do checks and balances for each point rather than tying it in because nesting uh, the elements isn't working. So I might have to run a script for these elements. Which isn't so bad, but I'm really bad with scripting. I'm I'm terrible. And then again, those are just like general ideas too. Might have to do the thing that uh Overlord does. Or sorry, overthrow. But even then that's uh that's gonna be really intense. What's generally supposed to happen is when you place these down, they should spawn, like, on the elements and stuff. So, what I can do... ...is actually set up the properties. But what we can do here is, like, set up an infantry group. We can, like, build these guys, for example. And what we can do is just tell these guys to defend. Get these guys moved around. Just so we got, like, some sort of element and stuff. I thought I could actually extend the radius of this thing. Guess not. Come on, guys. Come on, single file. Let's go. Billy Ubers. Yeah, it's gonna be the main thing. Once Bohemia fixes, uh, that bug that's been out since 1.1, that's actually gonna fix a lot of, uh, 
these issues, and I don't necessarily need to worry about the QRF stuff. We got hostile friendlies in the area. Hostile friendlies covering the road. Why? I told them to defend, go on patrol. They're not doing That's it. It's Richard Thomas and P Peter. Uh, oh God, he's getting in the Richard. fucking truck. <laughs> he's getting in the gunner. <laughs> <laughs> Richard Thomas wants to gun. <laughs> they shouldn't. There you go. At least we got reinforcements. Hooray. Hey, Riggs, you got a second? All right, sorry. Richard Martin. Thomas, no! <laughs> oh, no, there's... Oh, my God, look at the blood spatter on the... In the air. You see that? Yeah. Pretty cool. Very cool. Wait, what's your helmet? Oh, I thought you had a lieutenant for a second. I was going to be like, haha, you're a second lieutenant. Me, hey. No. All right, everyone. Grab your uh, ammo and shit, etc. We're on 32, right? Yeah. Okay. We'll take uh, this one. Just gonna load up with some more M2 ammo. There we go. Four more boxes. Let's go up to the quarry. Cut so off these QRF guys. The fucking thing. Uh, our friendly should be able to handle it. All right. I hope. So there's a guy at my company named Peter Enos. Peter Enos. Yeah, yeah. Like Weenus. Hey Johnny, so your Weenus is showing. Email. I think his email is P E N S. What's up, name? We had two servers, like one World War II dedicated and one other one for uh, modern. Punishment on my worst enemy. The fuel low? Fuck it. We'll find some gas stations. We'll take some of that Jerry oil. What's up, Desert? How you doing, brother? Job interview and the fucking email on your resume is p enis Oh my God, yes. I know somebody whose name is DJ Weed. That's actually pretty that awesome. That is not a real name. It is. I ref I'm sorry. I refuse to believe that is a real name. I went to her school with a like couple. Denise. Oh, her? Oh God. All right, let me see here. Yeah, this road. Good. Your how are you? Says Desert. Weed. Why would you ever? I need to look your, here, chat log Desert, and see how many times you've actually said those two lines together. A name I'm gonna I'm gonna put a counter up. Junior. Especially if it's a D name. DJ Weed. DJ Wiener. Like, I don't want it to show my driver's license to say that it's DJ Weed. Well, uh, why? You think a cop is going to be like, Now listen here, son, I don't like playing games. So get out so I can shoot you. I am scared to know. Oh, don't worry. I'm going to be checking your chat log here in a second when I die. Because I'm actually really curious. Oh, hey, Germans. just going to brutally arrest me. All right. Wait, did I forget my... Oh, shit, we forgot about the private. He wasn't in. I thought he was. Oh, shit. Oh, wait, no, he's running off. We're good. We're good. Okay, Phobia, push up to the front. I'm reloading. Once that's loaded, I'm going to drive you up. Almost good, Sergeant. Private Rider is almost here. Private Riders. We good? Shit. 
Got a full bag. Got a full bag. Oh, got a full bag. Some people can spawn on me. Got a full bag. We lost everyone in that push. Damn it. They should be able to spawn on me now. SL drop rally. Rally is up. You guys should be able to spawn on me. Let me double check, make sure. Uh, yeah. No, you, you guys can spawn on me. Rally's hot. Oh my god. John. Fucking squad days. Did John spawn in Phobia? Oh god. Fine, we'll do a flank. Move in through a uh, flank, try to get up on the uh, hillside so we can shoot down the Jerry's. I wish my vest had more capacity so I can bring like grenades. Just really sad that I can't. Green and dark. Ah, uh, not my problem. I'm a sergeant. Doctrine says that I'm important and you are a peon. Yeah, they should be able to spawn on me, so... Yeah, Thailand did a really good work making this map, though. I love how thick these forests are now and stuff. Very, very nice. Cannot spawn on you. Why can't you guys spawn on me? I'm confused. I don't know why they can't spawn on me. Is it because I'm too close or what? No, because he was able to spawn on Phobia. Rallies are broken on the radio pack. Fuck. Let me see if I can drop this and actually set one up. Let me see here. Because I'm not seeing like a... Uh... So I'm not seeing a deploy radio thing for these ones. So I might have to like go through and actually uh, dig down into the faction uh, thing and see what's going on. Really, really digging deep. So I looked like for a bit and I'm like, oh, everything's set up as it should, but I might need to go in even further. So that's a problem. Because really, I just looked at Phobia and stuff before and like it was working, but it's either one or two things. Either I'm too close or something else causing the issue. Sorry, they'll make it. They'll make their way back. Ooh, 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 ooh. Bobby, you pulled your uh, radio from the uh, bacon, right? Okay, I don't know why my radio's not working then. What the fuck happened? Oh my god. Yeah, I'm going to have to, uh, I'm going to have to redo the QRF stuff for a lot of this, uh, shenanigans, because this is definitely causing, uh, a little bit of an issue. Oh, 
Or do they just pull up with another vehicle and then they get clapped? No, that's the one I rolled up with. So I don't know why they're unable to spawn on me. That's that's the thing I'm really confused about. Because they're able to spawn on Phobia, but not me. And I am the squad leader. Oh, hey. Did you spawn on me, or...? You know, I, uh, so they, they're just, is it your, um, your script that makes them constantly spawn, or is that just part of the... So what I did, I just put it all, like, vanilla style, but nested them into the, uh, point, so when it's under I, our I'm control, it shouldn't happen. That. I'm talking about for the QRFs. That's what I'm talking about, too. Yeah, because they're just constantly yeah, spawning around the I, I don't know why that's, uh, happening, because it shouldn't happen. Uh, yeah. but it was all theoretical. Like, this shouldn't happen. We'll put a minefield around... That'll work, I'm sure. Yeah, there's also patrols too, but I nested everything in, so if the point isn't German, they technically shouldn't be spawning. So I don't know, I'm going to have to really think about how to uh, do something with that. Also, I couldn't spawn on you. I clicked on your name, and I saw you on the map, and it was tracking you. And then when I spawned, it put me on Phobia, so. That's that's weird. I wonder if I need right, to die. I'm going back to base, and I'll drive over here. You're alone for now. Yep. There's Jerry right there. That guy should be dead. One more for good measure. Man, I'm kind of sad that my uh, QRF uh, thing didn't really work out as planned. Cause it was actually really hard to test out on uh, editor side, but now that it's like made progress, now I can actually see if it's actually properly working or not. After a server restart, and it's like, nope, it's not. So I'm gonna have to really rethink it. I might have to do what Grams does and throw them out into the wood line, and like put them on like a two-hour timer or something like that. Yeah, I might have to do like several hours or something like that much rather because right now it's like set to 20 minutes It was I mean theoretically like because if you take a point and Nothing else like that's attached to it if you take it will respawn after restart and stuff So I was like, oh, okay if it's nested in that should stop it from happening. Oh, yes great idea, but Apparently if they're if they actually have a timer attached to them. That's not the case. So I think I'm gonna have to actually like do some actual legit scripting, like pull up uh, the whole entire code and everything, and actually write it all out. But that's gonna be hard because uh, Reforger uses more C++, while uh, Arma 3 used more HT uh, HTML style, and I'm not good with C++. I'm okay with HTML, but C++, ugh. I'm not. I'm not that skilled. I could easily just do like a, uh... Oh, man, almost got me. I could probably just do like some if-then statements for each group. But it's gonna be like, again, <clears throat> just a lot of like really thinking like, if point quarry under control German, then spawn group 214 or something like that. So that would be the only thing I can really think of, like something real baby simple, but knowing your forger, it's not that simple. Remember I join and stream in the server? I don't care. Go ahead. I do not care. I prefer people to stream this. Get, get more publicity on it. This is a lot of work and stuff, and uh, when I see, when I see the servers are not like populated and stuff, it just it's it hurts. I know the Cherno one isn't good. I know like I got to do a lot of work on that one, but 
Is that a guy with a Gewehr? We have friendlies on that side. What the hell? No, it's definitely a guy with a Gewehr. He's seeing something. There he is. Ow. It's me, let me to throw chest. Hiya. Alright. Grant oh Grant actually has a lot of resources. I could, if worse comes to worse, I can just go back to my patrol style. But the thing is, like, if the patrol's here, um, any engines or anything, they'll, they'll try to push in. But generally, though, with the ambience, they're just looking like they'll spawn in and people are nearby. And if they attack, they attack. You know, that kind of thing. The fuck? What's this? Someone just dropped a bunch of backpacks on the ground, dude. What the hell? Let me check the uh, let me check the building thing. See if there's any jeeps. So I don't know if uh, Desert grabbed a jeep or not. So I'm gonna go ahead and see if there is anything. So I don't know if they actually uh, put him in and updated the thing, but I think I'm gonna have to do a push on the uh, on the mission file itself if they do do that. <clears throat> because right now I can't add anything in, just how they have it all set up, which is big sad. Let's see. Nope, no Jeeps. We still got the trucks. So that's been like the number one complaint from a lot of people is they put down a big ass truck just to get from one point to another. And then, uh, and then the arsenal too. So like right now we need to have like an admin kind of like watch over the point and be like, all right, they took it. They're building an arsenal. All right. Plop down the actual base game arsenal because the one that it's built, if they have a flag over it, you can't pull any medical supplies whatsoever. And, like, I thought they fixed it, or they were going to fix it over the weekend. I don't know why Charlie hasn't done that yet, though. I, I don't know what's going on. I might have to ask, like, hey, guys, you got a lot of attention on your shit. Like, here's the two main problems. Can we please get a Fix for that ASAP. You guys said you were gonna do. Smile. The thing is too, like if other people decide to like pull the mod or something like that, they put it up on their server, and then they uh, especially this conflict mode, they're like, oh, we built an arsenal, but uh, there's no medical supplies. Then it's it just looks kind of bad. I'm just gonna want to put because I also want to see like the tree lines and stuff. put another supply depot out here somewhere probably at that log farm actually kind of build that up uh, I need to see what kind of like if Germans have any tents or anything like that put something down might just put units down that don't respawn right there so it's kind of like one and done because generally speaking if you have already pushed through this area and eliminated the Germans there shouldn't be any more 
I could probably do that with the QRF too, but uh, since it saves the scenario, if they don't really push any lines, there might not be any QRF following suit. Yeah, I'm just really racking my brain how I can actually fix the QRF stuff to do what I wanted to do because I really want to try to pull up the uh, liberation style where periodically um, enemy forces will try to take back positions and stuff like that. Because I know with like Gramps PvE Remix, it was definitely really weird. Uh, that was kind of like one of the weird complaints we got from people is uh, they'd be chilling at a position that's way behind friendly lines, like really far back, and all of a sudden they'd be attacked by Russians. Which, I mean, granted, in a modern sense, like, yeah, you'd probably, like, push off into random areas and stuff like that, you know, try to, you know, get behind enemy lines and stuff like that. But that's a little bit of a challenge. It's definitely really challenging trying to make this uh, work and how I envision. I might have to actually uh, get dropped back down to Earth and uh, might not be able to pull something like that. I need coffee. We're going to chill at this rock. We're going to chill at this rock. I'm going to get some coffee. I'll be right back, chat. Let's leave you guys with some uh, nice, uh, nice calming music. How's that sound?
Okay. I got my coffee. I'm happy. Yeah, that's at the quarry. We're good. Whoops, a daisy. I swear, one of these days I'm gonna break my coffee mug. Let's see which channel are we on. It doesn't look like it was on 32. 38. Hey, man, copy. Nope, we're on 32. Even though it says not. Anyone copy? Saw a copy. There we go. Let's see, what position are they on the hill? They're on the east side. Someone's got a 30, going fucking crazy. Actually, no, that's a bar. Did Desert just fall to his death? Yeah, I wonder who could have saw that coming. What what happened to Desert? He he jumped off to see if he would take fall damage and he did. Oh my god. He forgot to shoot. Oh man. What a hell of a way to die. He ain't gonna jump no Fucking more. beat me by one <laughs> second, I swear to god. <laughs> Alright, you wanna bring the Jeep down? Yeah, we gotta bring it down in style, though. Oh, Jesus. You get a fucking... Oh, my God. Let me move the one out of here. It's Cabin. Cabin? Fuck yeah. All right, let's see this. Chat, let's see, let's see how well this goes, okay? I guarantee they're gonna explode. Hi, my name's Hollow, and welcome to Jackass. You okay? I'm good. It's pretty we, cool, huh? 
If this was Armor 3, we would have fucking exploded. <laughs> I'm so used to Armor 3. I'm like, yeah, you guys are going to explode. Dead. It's a little worse for wear, if I'm being honest. Yeah, it looks like uh, the engine is uh, not looking so hot. Pumping it's out fine. some thick black smoke there. I did get a little bit of XP there because I transported troops. Uh. Oh, fantastic. Broad AT. The last thing I want is a panther showing up. This thing has no traction. We lost the tires. You lost? Well, geez, I wonder how that happened. Yeah, I mean, we didn't even land on the tires. We landed I, on the fucking. I have a wrench. Let me take a look at it. Hey, John, you want to come? I want to stop it first here? and turn off the engine. No, it'll be fine. My lord. All right, let me check to see uh, everything around ah. here. So yeah, so these guys are still uh, going around. So these guys came to, came up from here. So yeah, these guys are patrols. Same for these guys, but we never went up over there. But um, same for these elements. So, these guys shouldn't be here. So, as this point's taken, these guys should despawn. It's basically how I have it relatively set up. It's relatively annoying that it's not working as intended. But it's weird because over here, I have several, I and I mean no several units pushing out, me. but there's only one. So, I'm actually kind of confused. What if I messed up some of them? Might have to just take a quick look at the uh, QRF page and stuff like that. Same for all those guys, but they should be dead. Maybe it's not too much of an issue, but I don't know. Sniper section. Sniper section. Do they even have... Oh, the Germans don't even have scope cars. So, yeah. It's weird because it's like some of them are doing it, some of them are not. So I wonder if I messed up some of the elements there. Hey, hey, Sergeant. Huh? So private, uh, private desert went for a swim. Uh huh. He took off all his clothes and stuff, and uh -huh. he just left his gun on the shore. So there it is. You had That's no accountability. He. Yeah. Oh my gosh. All right. Well. You should keep your uh, your boys in order there, uh, Sergeant. Yeah, you're right. Where is he? He might still be in the... Oh, look. He's looking for his gun, I think. Oh. There he is. Uh, hey, at, least, at least he kept his underwear on. Did you leave yeah. the weapon unattended? No. Really? Because I don't it, see it here. Yeah, I don't see your weapon. What happened to your weapon there, Private? Look at the way he runs. It's so <laughs> Where's your German gun, Private? Took it. Oh, some German oh. took it because it was unaccounted for? Because he didn't have a battle buddy watch Where's over it? A rocket launcher as well? Oh, what do you water. know? I found this Thompson laying on the side of the lake with no one watching over it. Wow. Hold on. What serial number is this? Oh, Desert, it's your serial number. <laughs> oh wow, man! Ah, oh, I can't wait to report this to the captain on how we have a dumb fuck not accounting his weapons in the time of war. That's punishable by death. You should report it to the major, sergeant. I should report it to the major. Hey, major! I found this unaccounted for Thompson laying on the side of the freaking lake. Oh, who does it belong to? Why it belongs to Private Desert. That's incorrect. It belongs to the U.S. <laughs> Army. Oh shit! <laughs> oh no! There you, there you it's go. It's long to him. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> All right, 
let's get it. Hopefully we have enough supplies here to get a radio tower. If not, we're gonna have to transport some up. All right. Um, let's see. Where's that? Uh, hey, where did our transport truck go? That was that we brought up. Uh, it was over here on the road. Yeah, it was over right here on the gate. Well, I mean, we did all die, so maybe somebody took it. God, I swear to God, some German took it. Hello. Oh shit. Uh, Sergeant. Probably good. Yes. That uh, Jeep's only got three seats, so it looks like it's uh, officers and NCOs, you know? Nah, it's fine. Yeah, let me fucking repair your engine so you don't blow up. Uh, Soul, do you copy? Actually, I just relay this on 48. Is Soul even here? Oh, wait. I see the problem. This fucking backpack is not on our fucking net key. That's why sometimes it doesn't let us respond and shit. Why? Oh, what was that desert? Smoke. Oh. I might have to put in the actual base game one. I got test on yeah. That, that is that silly. Be. Does the base game one work? Uh, for Sol, are you able to get a transport truck with a 50 on it from your position, fill it up with some supplies, bring it up to the quarry? He might be on 38. I did it on a uh, platoon net. Does he have an LR? Uh, I don't think he has a radio, period. Uh, He's probably not going to be able to see it. Hey, uh, Private, you want a job? Sure. Hey, uh, Sergeant. Yeah. You want to delegate a job to your man? Yeah, hey, Desert, I need you to go to Duras and get us a transfer truck and fill it up with supplies, okay? Okay. All right, good. Hey, a German. <laughs> now, Sergeant. There's an American flag here. What are you going to do? Okay. What's, what's the salute key again? You just hold on, tip. I need to put on bonnet, bonnet animations back in. Til tilde. There's a couple of mods I missed because I was just heavily testing on a lot of stuff here. Okay, now this is weirding me out, okay? So some of the elements are spawning on the points for the QRF, quote-unquote, and some of them are not. And I'm really confused. So I think I might have just fucked up somewhere. It's like the sniper section. Those guys are responding. But then there's elements that are supposed to be pushing down to St. Pierre that are not responding. Because these guys are going to go up to uh, here to reinforce that. So I might have to just recheck everything. Maybe something got uh, dissociated. I'm going to have to actually really recheck uh, a lot of these. So this, this element here, this is a patrol. Time for this. I have these guys moving from over here, over here, and they're on a respawn timer. I might actually pump up those or actually get rid of them, but yeah, those guys should actually be, since they're tied into Duras and all the other stuff, one is attached to Quarry. Uh, they should be moving off to, it's just really confusing. Like I could have sworn like nesting uh, these elements into the point would actually do it, but it looks like it's not actually doing it. Maybe actually setting them on a patrol hierarchy to move to the point is actually causing them to break that hierarchy. Ah, it's just, it's, it's weird. Oh, what's going on? Infantry contacts, E. Raj. I, I hate that team is pushed in. Just rebuy it. Ow. Ouchies. I can't believe I died. It's 
spin why you dying don't be dying i, I, don't I can't know. believe you died i can't believe it either also i can't desert you forgot to load that thing up with supplies i'm loading this one Oh my god, I told them, get a truck, load up with supplies. Oh my god. Like, actual supplies to build. Yeah, I'll get those too. Ah, I'm getting it. Because my transport okay. truck just went down the fucking road. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want me to spot another transport truck? No, it's fine. Looks like he's on his way back. Alright, I got 50 belts in there now, so we're good. 50 belts, you're god. 50, no, 50 I mean belts? Like, like, no, no, yeah. no, no, like 50 belts, just not 50 Yeah, because everyone's at 32. Nah, nah, 50 belts of 50, yeah. No, not that, god yes. damn. Yes, yes, 50 belts of 50, let's go. I'm gonna be honest, I don't know how to get supplies. Oh, it's really simple, pull that over to the uh, command tent. You guys go on ahead. So to do it, like, pull this up to either, like, any uh, facility depot. So, for example, more common, you're gonna pull it up from the command post right here. All right, put on that handbrake. And then get out. Now in the back here, it's gonna say load supplies, and then you're just gonna load it up that way. I thought you put on the handbrake. What's going on here, Desert? You didn't put on the handbrake, Desert. Uh, it's double tap do spacebar, Desert. Uh, Goddamn yeah, privates. There you go. And then yeah, then up. Oh. Yeah, then you can just load in supplies. You can go to any like facility. And then you can just load it up and stuff. That's how you do it. But the other, uh, you don't need to load it all. Just, uh, actually, we're going to unload this because we got 600 in the other one. That's all we really need. So we can actually move this all back in so people can, uh, keep respawning here. There we go. All right. Let's get, let's get to the quarry. Let's make sure the other truck doesn't get, uh, absolutely whacked. Oh my God, how, why can't I get in the passenger? Fuck okay, it, I'm getting in the back. All right, we're good to go. Uh, supply truck, are you guys good? We're hearing a lot of shooting on the MSR. Oh shit, Jerry's. Drive, drive, drive. Hopefully our boys at Duras will be able to hold the line. I'm gonna do something real fast. Are we going here? Yes. Am I going to the right spot? Yeah, you're going the right way. Yeah, we're, we're going up to the quarry, so just keep going. It's all right. Germans don't know how to shoot straight, all right? That's what... Ow, fuck, they shot me. Why is the Germans here? Oh, where's our team? Where, where, where did everyone go? Where did everyone go? Did they push off from here? I thought they were still up here. What the fuck?
Nina says this at the quarry. The Germans are taken again. Oh my god. Oh my god, they did push up over there. Oh, those fuckers. They didn't even bring supplies to the quarry. They just, oh my god. I'm gonna smack them. I'm gonna smack Soul. Swear to god. Okay. We're just gonna put down a bunch of Jeeps here because I'm tired of, uh, We'll just put a few jeeps down. Hey, right, Oscar, how's it going, brother? Ira, Mike, Bernard, some fine damn good Americans have I ever seen any? I just heard Russian. What? I just heard a, a fucking Russian next. Oh uh, yeah, there's thing. enemies here on the north, on northwest, basically. Northwest, yeah. When we pass by the field. From this house. All right, I'll check the creek. Yeah, shit. German down. Heard a shot southwest. Got our American boys right there. They're engaging something over to the direct west. Yep, there they are. Two Germans. That's one fucking nice kitty right there. Ah, uh, let's see. Were you check 32? Oh, why is the camera not working? Hopefully when, uh, because I lost power for a bit. Oh, God. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There we go. I'm definitely going to have to get a light source or something to bring over the, uh, the thing. Tomorrow I'm getting all the parts that I need to actually get that set up. I'm having a seizure, it's fun. Dead? <laughs> Look at this. Oh, Jesus Christ. You're dead. John, what the fuck? I'm busted. You are so busted. I can't even die. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor John. Yeah, but I'm, I'm getting everything I need so I can actually work and stuff. Actually, I want to check something real fast. I'm going to check the filters. Because I don't know why there's chroma key attached to it by default, which is really weird. Let me see if that fixes it. A little bit. This is it a little bit. But yeah. Lay down for like 40 minutes. I'll be lurking now. All right, GG. Hope you have a good nap. Goddamn Jerry's, I tell you what, brother. You know what? I'm gonna take a Thompson out. It's it's a fun weapon. We're gonna have some fun with it. Although I wish the vest uh was able to hold more, honestly. I wonder if I should just put in the base game uh radio pack, honestly. I wonder if I should actually really do that to uh, fix some of the other weird issues. Because for some reason, the SCR 300 radio backpack um, is not making a solid connection. So I wonder if it's actually tied in with that radio key that's originally on this. But we'll see. And I put in the airborne vest. 
in here. I don't know why it's not showing up. I mean, it is, but it's not, if you guys catch what I'm saying. So we'll just, uh, yeah. So that's weird. On the editor side, it was showing and everything, but on here it's not, so I'm gonna have to actually get rid of that. But then I'm gonna put in the uh, base game radio pack and see if that fixes uh, some weird issues on top of it. Unless I can change the faction key with it, make it prefab and put it in. There might be the possibility. All right, I think our boys here are able to hold the line. Let's go ahead and get a Jeep and push up to the quarry. Uh oh, Sven, you got the Xbox 360 mic. Do I really? Yeah. All right, give me a second here. We're gonna have to just do a quick reconnect here. Put that in there for now. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bam. I would have to update the photos too, because we don't have the tanks, because they were uh, actually breaking the server really bad when they exploded and stuff. I could also do a test and uh, pull in, uh, well, it doesn't even matter because I can't even put any vehicles in the frickin', uh, frickin' sheet at all. It sucks, but whatever. Radio. Do I sound better? No, about the same. Holy fucking shit. So I'm doing a quick disconnect would actually fix it. Oh well, it's not too. Let's bad. check with Desert. Desert, how do I sound? A little weird. Okay, let me do a full hard restart. All right, give me a second here, chat. I think when I tried fixing the camera, it decided, haha, funny. Actually, while we're doing this, let's take a quick intermission so I can show you guys uh, kind of what I did here and where the possible mistake might be as we uh, fix some of the stuff here. Here, let's take a let's take a quick look here as we look at my beautiful background. Okay, so <clears throat> let's go ahead and just take a look here on uh, some of the QRF forces because uh, maybe some of you guys have a general idea here. Maybe my idea is just completely silly. This is absolute. I'm 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 a little heartbroken that it it didn't work. How I imagined. I was really hoping someone would be all like, "Hey, Germans are spawning right on this position here." Also, I'm, I'm going to go through and actually put it more uh, machine gun nests around the map. I kind of stopped around uh, Levy area, but I am going to be doing that in the next big update. But my main focus is a QRF. So basically, let's go and take a look right here. So um, we got the resort here. All right. Actually, let's get some music in the background. How does Chowder Man sound, guys? So, hold on, give me a second here. We're gonna drop that down a little bit. Okay, so they are tied in, they are nested. And just hit me on that one point and seem to do it. However,. I like the E right, I 
So nesting them in there isn't doing it. It's not hitting the point, which is sad. So even if we take a look at Duras here, for example, they're not actually nested in, which is kind of a big sad. <clears throat> I haven't said for 20 minutes because the idea was if the point gets taken, nested in, which is doing the call out for the Germans, um, it's just not doing it. So, I wonder if it's just not how I was thinking. So, let's go ahead and see if there's an SCR somewhere. one so there's a lot of uh, objects display sites let me see if there's something for respawn respawn briefing respawn component so let's take a look at this one real fast scripted game mode description for respawn component Find can be used to enable respawn component uh, menu, blah, blah, blah. So that's for the... So this is just calling for when the player wants to spawn in. That's what this is uh, calling for. Nothing really much else here. This is where I'm saying, like, this is going to get really difficult to try to do, is pumping in something. Respawn system component. Let's see what we got here. Is this calling for players? Is this calling for AI? So that's for players, sadly enough. Tickets. Editor, you got respawn timer. That's not what we're looking for either. Yeah, so all that's for players and stuff, so that's not really gonna help out uh, with what we got going on here. What if there's AI respawn? Let me let me go and see here. Now, um, what about AI spawn? How about AI? Hmm. I'm really not seeing a whole lot here, so I don't think my idea is gonna work for battle lines and stuff. If anything, I'm probably gonna have to set up the timers dramatically higher, and actually have them like kind of do a little push in thing. That's going to be something I'm going to be doing on my own time, though. So, that's all right. So, unfortunately, there wasn't really anything I could really see. Anyways, let's get back in there. Let's get back in there. Let's uh, have some fun. I'll be fixing that tonight. I've kind of dedicated tonight to kind of doing more with the, uh, with the stuff and uh, as a whole. So, that's fine. Hopefully, this fixes my uh, microphone being all funny. That usually happens when I decide to plug in a USB in and out. Like my camera. Smile. So I am probably gonna have to do the old school way of doing things. But it was all right, not too bad. It was worth a shot. It was worth a shot trying to do something interesting, but 
I'm definitely gonna have to like push up the timers a lot more probably an hour and a half or two hours in certain areas and stuff and then uh, probably lowering the German squad count to really make it seem like it was a small element that slipped through behind enemy lines kind of situation. It's all right. Okay. Let's see, we got an element pushing off from Quarry. Uh, we'll go down to Grant. And we'll just uh, try to make do with what we can here. <clears throat> and then it's all right, because then I can put down more ambience, put down the uh, the shenanigans, more machine gun nest, and then uh, hopefully at the same time I can communicate with the Overlord team and say, hey. That better have been a German you're shooting at. Me and Joel playing catch with a grenade. And then oh. <laughs> All right, we got some jeeps here. Let me get my stuff and then let's uh, regroup with the uh, main element. It still don't sound a little weird, by the way. Uh, it'll probably refix itself. I hope that was one of you that threw that. It was. I was playing catch with Desert and he threw it to me and you just walked up as the grenade was laying at my feet. <laughs> Oh, those are Jerry's behind us. What the fuck? Where's all of our friendlies at? Where's all of our friendly forces? What happened to them? They're all dead. You sound beautiful, dude. I, I don't know why it's doing this, to be honest. Is you like sound do I sound absolutely beautiful. Do I sound the same like on my stream, by the way? You, no, you uh, sound no, fine you sound, on stream. Okay, it's just like in here. It's just weird connection. Webcam. That's. I love it. it. Sounds like he's talking through a fucking laptop camera. Wait, my, hold on. Uh, my, so my laptop camera on my work computer is like terrible, and everybody else has like a laptop camera that looks good, but mine is always like super yellow. <laughs> it looked like the other day uh, when I was on. So the for some reason, default us. switched over to my cat camera, which is on the other side of the oh, room. Hey, do you have hey. cat camera? Uh, cats aren't there. Right, I'm gonna get the full setup tomorrow, so. Then it's gonna be uh, I can't cat cams back cat. up. Do I sound yeah, better so... now? Yeah. No. Uh, okay. You sound more clear, but I wouldn't say you sound better. Wow. Okay. I think you sounded perfect just the way you were. Get out of here! That's all I gotta get ammo with this fucking. No. All right, we're gonna push up. Uh, perfect. We're gonna push up to Levy. Uh, we might need to have someone get a transport truck. Wow. Phobia. You're gonna get shot. <laughs> <laughs> he already did get shot. All right. Uh, oh, okay, no. Technically, I got blown up okay, by a grenade. Fine. There's a difference. Yeah, okay, beautiful. You in the nuts, too. Ah, uh, German. What the fuck are they shooting at? Uh, I do see it. All, a German over there. All right. Uh, hey, Desert, you're going to drive this with John. Really I'm going to be in the rear with a transport truck filled with supplies, okay? Uh, where's the fucking Wait, truck why don't we just get an arm It's over arm here. Transport truck. That's what I'm doing. It works at both things. Oscar, how you doing, brother? You're a Mike! Mike's been shot! What's wrong, Mike? Oh, you're fine. Don't be a pussy. Oh damn, I missed every shot. He's at uh 130 my position in that fucking tree line out yonder there. Did I kill that guy? Yeah, he's dead. him in the arm Good. 
gonna have to get more fucking ammo, dear god. Alright, we should be good. Oh, there's still one out there. Is there? Yeah, I saw him moving about 120-ish. 120-ish? Oh, that guy. There he is. Good kill. Good kill. For 9mm, this thing slaps. Yeah, no, they uh, they did the MP40 uh, pretty good. They did a lot, like, all these weapons are good. I'm just so used to IFA3 where every single weapon was absolute dog dog poopy. And everyone's complaint was, well, there's no buffer swing. I'm like, yeah, but I, you don't lose your sight picture that fucking hard. You have a uh, MP40 mag kind of uh, floating in front of your left nipple. Uh, I'm sure that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. This is the worst thing that can happen. Oh, I know, right? All right, we'll load up supplies in here. We'll get some ammo in this thing because we're gonna need more M2 ammo. I need more uh, Thompson ammo. All right, we'll pull this in front of the uh, arsenal. Bada bing, bada boom. Uh Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's enough boxes there. And uh we'll load up some other shenanigans we got here with this Thompson ammo. Yeah. tomorrow i'll take a look all right uh we're good going in an m2 i just need to check something real fast once we're in let, let me see it's for my eyes only chat sorry get absolutely fucked <gasps> oh yes oh i can't wait that's gonna be so much fun i'm uh i'm really excited about that All right. We're gonna have contacts on our left. Get ready to do a drive-by. We gotta give him an old American classic. Contacts front, left, right, all over. I bring gift, thing with a bed, smile. Good night, Teds. You were working hard today. Get some nice rest, man. Is that an MG42? That's an MG42 like shooting at us. I don't know from where. Probably at that fucking house over there. Uh, Up in the hill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit it, hit it, hit it. We're going to keep driving. Out of ammo. Reloading.
All right, we got friendly forces up ahead. We'll park right behind them. Hey, if you guys are trying to reach me, I wasn't on net, but uh, we got supplies, uh, ammo, uh, no medical though. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna head up the uh, into the woods here uh, and get up a good position over the enemy. All right, uh, sounds good. Be careful! There was uh, two columns worth of Germans up ahead. We went through and then we turned around and came back. Cause uh, yeah. I uh, was that heavy. They call them. Well, they're all dead now, I think, so I'll kill most of them with the 50, so... Yeah, no, there's still a lot more in the tree. Are you sure you want to go up the hill? I mean, we got that military base directly on our west. So we're going to get pincered if we move up to the west. If we head direct north, maybe we can cut in through the trees here and uh, push in from the east. Unless you want to hit the military base first, I mean... Yeah, I was thinking hit the military base first. Okay, yeah, we can do that. more men, and if we yeah. hit the military base first... I think Dude, I'm taking the first. military base might delay any QRF. Yeah, I mean, if we yeah, had true. more people, I'd say hit them both at the same time, but... Yeah. Make sure we're all tracking. Are we all on 32 or 38? I thought we were I don't have a long range. 32? 32? Okay. This uh, okay. stolen kit doesn't have a radio. <laughs> you dumbass. <laughs> I don't know why. Um, um, I got my radio. Yeah, uh, we'll do 32 since most of us are already on there. What's up, Chris? Yeah, so uh, there's there's definitely decent views up on the military base from over here. We were up there. I don't know if we're gonna. Oh, man, be able to I don't know why, but my OBS seems to be struggling a little bit with some with that uh Jeff oh, there. Join up on my group, so we're all together. Oh, okay. Was it P? Uh, how do I do that? Uh, yeah. I made it bigger so we can fit everybody in there. Ah, uh, okay. How do I do that again? Main ground. Uh, press P. P. Uh, Puma. We lost the major. I don't think he's dead. He's not dead. We need a medic over here. I'm not a medic. He's fucking dead. It's kind of live. Uh, server's doing good. I need to fix the QRF thing. It didn't work how I intended. Uh, there's still QRF spawning on points that are under control. So nesting the QRF into the point didn't work. So I'm going to have to like go back to an old system. So the whole entire point of like, you know, as a battle lines move, that moves too. It didn't really work. Also, there seems to be issues with the radio. People aren't spawning. So I'm going to, I'm probably going to have to put in the base game one. Because I think, uh, because it's either... We all don't talk on the radio, which is going to make things really hard for a public server. Or we spawn, so I'm going to put in the base game one. Uh, just, it is what it is kind of situation. Up the hill, up the hill. Directly up the hill. 229. Got it. Yeah, see, you got him. Desert's down again. Hey, get some guys to push up on that hillside and start building some trenches. Glory to the motherland! Wait. Damn. They are after it, folks. And they probably heard your fucking M2 and came to investigate. Probably. Where is that guy? Let's double tap his ass. Ah, uh, he's right here. It was an officer. Bitch. ACP. Both of those wars big, big, baby. Round. I'm glad I brought some binos. Yeah. Well, this place has a large POW camp at it. Yeah. Got some cherries, 290. A lot of them. It's the Brits that call them Jerry's. I don't fucking care. 
I thought it was Americans. I don't know. No, the Americans called them crowds, I think. I think, I think we just call them whatever. Alright, I'm gonna build some quick trenches right here just so we have some uh, nice cover while we shoot down at these fuckers. In the backpack ready, yeah? Yeah, so basically the radio backpack, sometimes people can spawn off them, sometimes they can't. But it's also because I had to set the faction uh, radio frequency. It was originally set, I think, to work with this radio on the backpack, which was a weird, like, F FIA one. Um, but I had to switch to the chicken nugget just for the radio, unless I put in the other one. But I'll, I'll have to do some, like, more thorough investigation. Because if I can just put in the other one, which is the FIA one, and then this radio works, then cool. But uh, again, it's going to be a lot of double checking. Because if that's the case, that's an easy fix. Shot south? Because the uh, the base vanilla NATO one is uh, definitely more futuristic, and I know it's going to, like... We lost rigs! Control. Sink shoots high. No, the first shot's on point, but the, the kick. Yeah, with no deploying it too, so I'm like really confused. And I checked the other one too, and that didn't work either. And I'm trying to find uh, in the files on how to make that happen. And the thing is, I set it to a radio backpack, how it should be, but it's still not working. So I don't know it's how uh, Charlie set up the faction itself. If there's something missing in the background or whatnot, but oh, I accidentally held by. I got a funny perspective. <laughs> oh, you have the uh, Arma Vision Photoshop thing. I, I Here's do. something north by northwest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck. We got two KIA. We need to get off this hill. Go. Start pulling back. Now nah, we. Need, okay, yeah. East, east. Yeah, I think I know what needs to be done. I could probably fix that right now and push up and up, push out an update. Pick like the worst possible spot here. But I got trenches up. Yeah, but we can flank down, like, and push to the southwest. Yeah, well, we don't. We, let's push back up and hold off till we get more men back here. That sounds good. There's, uh, there's some rocks up here that I was just at. Yeah, no, that's a decent position. It's the position I was thinking of. I wasn't. Uh, we have no way to set up like a spawn here, dude. No, we? there's no way to set up a radio backpack, so I don't know how uh, Charlie set up the faction manager. Because normally it works just fine if I add in, say, radio backpack, but none of it's working. There's no way at all to set a respawn? Uh, no. That's unfortunate. Yeah, so I might have to either A, um... Put in the base game blue for vanilla radio backpack. I mean, it's it doesn't it, it's not terrible looking, so I it probably would be fine. I mean that's what we did for Mike Force too, so yeah. So I might have to do that. But even then, like when I put down the base game and editor testing, I couldn't actually deploy that radio either. So that tells me, Close uh, over here. yeah. So that tells me something uh, wacko is going on with the faction uh, itself. Then again, this was more set up for GM than conflict. That's how yeah. Charlie did it. So. If we can try to set up some uh, trenches here. John! So I need to run back. I need more Thompson ammo. Hold the line. Actually, fuck it. I'm going to get yeah, some okay. trenches up. Actually, get the ammo off John. Did he have Thompson or M1? Fucking take it if you, do, if you have an M1. You're 100% right. Cover me. It's not looting if he's dead. Wait, yes it is. Fuck you. Alright. I'm gonna get these trenches built up over here. Some FIA channel originally. I think it was. I'm just kinda guessing, but it was like a weird name. So um, I changed the faction radio key to, uh, what it is for Blue 4 originally, which is chicken nuggets. Uh, so these handheld radios can work. Um, but if it is actually an FIA radio channel, I can just add in the, uh, 
FIA handheld radio, which is going to be weird, but I don't think anyone's going to like double guess it, I think, so but or a, or a I, I have a car, uh, carbine. Shit. If you have a grenade, throw him down the fucking hill. Shit. Oh shit. It's Kanye West. Man, these Jerry's are fucking pissed off, man. Y you think? We plowed through an armor, through an infantry column or two. Time to try to take away the slip leave. All right, first line completed. It's not bad. Good for the first initial push. I don't know what happened to Desert. He's just gone now. Someone's shooting from over there. I got no eyes. It's kind of taking some guessing shots. Let's say. Oh my God! This. Why did you have? 30 Thompson max in your backpack. Did John have Thompson ammo? Oh, you motherfucker. Did. Yeah. I, I just took like half the Let's ammo. Let's go. From you can have the other half if you want your Thompson. <gasps> There's like 15 mags in there, I think. Uh, Rick, Let's fucking go. Let's, Let's get, get in very folks. Yeah. Taking point. Fuck you! Fuck you! Oh, I was gonna go beat him down. I was gonna go punch him, man. Oh, fucking A. Okay. Uh, let's take a quick look here. Uh, so you guys can get understand uh, what I'm talking about earlier. Uh, give me a second here. So, let's take a uh, very quick gander at this real fast. Um, so anyways, if we take a look at, um... What we got going on here. Because uh, I do want to try to fix that deployed radio issue. And I might be able to be able to do a very quick fix right here. And then fixing the QRF stuff is going to be painful. <laughs> a little annoying. But I might be able to do it. But it's not going to be the image of like how it is in Armor 3 Liberation where as a battle line moves... The QRF also moves around and stuff, so I might have to do the old school way, uh, how I did it on my uh, other conflicts, unfortunately. But I'm going to have to increase their respawn timer to some ludicrous amount. Maybe an hour would probably be the best bet. But if we take a look at the inventories thing here, uh, we might be able to figure out um, how we can actually fix it. Because definitely how the faction manager for World War One 
something seems a little bit uh whacked out. But if we take a look at the items here, let's go and take a look at the backpacks real fast. So if we take a look at the backpack radio, it's a radio backpack, how it should be. We got the arsenal data. It's a radio backpack, which should also allow the deploying. But let's go ahead and take up the base game faction manager as well. So we pull up the base game faction manager that's strategically put on the asset layer because I'm an idiot. Put it over here in managers so I can actually do a quick looks a daisy here. So I want to see what the uh, what these guys are called. So anyways, we don't want vehicles. We don't want this multi-list. What we want here is the backpacks real fast. So the radio backpack is still on default and everything else, and this actually deploys it down on the ground, which is fine. But also, this radio backpack I think it's more tied into the frequency of chicken nuggets. But what is FIA's radio channel? Candle sauce. <laughs> Candle sauce. Okay, so they picked one that was completely random. Not necessarily random, but uh, dramatically different. So if we do take uh, Operation Overlord's faction manager here, let's take a look at what they have for the base game one. So for their base game, they have this weird battle wah wah going on. Um, now let's go and take a look. I want to see what the FIA has for the radio backpack. Because if it's the SCR 3000 and it's a base game one, then that kind of tells me that they're using something completely different here. So I don't know where this other backpack is coming from then which is the SCR 3000. So oh, it's definitely one that they have are pulled and then tied that one in. So interesting. Let me try this here. Because since all of them are going to have their own frequency, we're going to see if I just pull in the base game one and throw it down if it actually still works as intended as my Freaking manager here breaks. Here we go. Let's get rid of FIA. I just want to make sure I'm grabbing the correct one here and make sure it's actually set up correctly. So it's the ANPRC 77. Come on, come on, let's go. All right. So this backpack too didn't work. In editor it worked, but on the server it is not working. So we're gonna change this one here. Uh, let's go ahead and go into Armory Forger, Prefabs, and let's see, we'll do ERC-77. We'll just grab this guy right here. I got radio station. But now that's not what we want. So we're going to grab that there. We're going to call this, uh, let's see, radio backpack. Keep that on default. And we're going to see if this actually works how it should. The main thing is, is being able to drop it on the ground and be able to set up a mobile radio position. It's going to be the, the bigger position or the, the freaking idea of all this so let's get rid of these faction managers so nothing gets weirded out there we go do a quick test we'll teleport myself away drop down an arsenal let's see if that works in theory it should since it's tied into the same radio channel as well Four chicken nuggets. That doesn't work. I wonder if I actually strategically set off the wrong uh, setting for deployable radios.
I need to fix some of these uh, spawn points too. I need to make sure they're actually uh, snapped to the ground, which I don't think I strategically did correctly. Normal I do, sometimes they get weirded out though. Come on, baby. Come on, child. Gotta wait for the AI to all spawn in. Let's listen to some background music. How's that sound? Come on, give me up to 700. Come on, let's go. Got a lot of AI in this map. So this is why testing an editor is usually getting more and more difficult as things go on. So what we have down so far, if everything works, and I know going forward everything else is going to work just fine. Should be, in theory. There we go. This one, we're just gonna open up the arsenal, just make my life just a little bit easier. Okay. That might have told me something. With that air popping up. So normally I just kind of go through bacon. What the hell's the backpack on this? Okay, so I think with that thing that popped up, definitely uh, told me something that might be missing out in here. Which is a huge good thing. Which I'm pretty sure that one's located within the game mode. So I think I actually did mess something up. Strategically messed it up. Come on, virtual machine. I know you're chugging. Come on. Let's go. Come on. There we go. So here's the thing, it's enabled right here. But why is it not tied into these radios? Because it's all enabled.
So I don't know why it's uh, doing that. Yeah, because it's all set up correctly. What's it that? Maybe that's just something that it was doing. So if we hit that, maybe that works. That's probably what was missing out of it. But I'll check some of the other ones though. We'll just save this, uh, what we got going on. I'll do some more tests, uh, later. We're gonna have to do a lot of, uh, testing outside of, uh, outside of that shenanigans. We'll close, uh, once the map ends. The editor. We'll save all. Bada bang. Let's wait for our resources to pop back in. There we go. Okay. Once we take these points up here, um, definitely should, uh, should start helping a lot. And then I can go and test. And then if it all actually works correctly, then, uh, we'll be good to go. up brother no no get right in there we go I'll be waiting right here. All right, let's see where our guys are. Okay, so they actually made it inside the position, which is great. Oh, shit. Actually, I'm going to move in the back side of this house here. Copy. Fucking Jerry's don't know when to quit. One shot, one kill, all luck, no skill. I see, like, right now you can't see my respawn radio. Uh, well, there's one great way to test that. Let me go ahead and save my kid and see. But the thing is, like, it works, and then sometimes it doesn't work. I'm really confused why that's happening. So, like, John was able to spawn on Phobia, but he wasn't able to spawn on me. So... I am gonna do some like side testing on my sh on my own to see if uh, I can fix any of that. All right, I'm gonna test something real fast. <laughs> no worries. All right. Um, where are you? Yeah. So I'm not finding your radio. So I think there's something that is either A, something up with the faction manager, or B, something that messed up with the settings that I put on. Ladders are dangerous. Are they now? My ankles hurt. 
They're not that dangerous. No. Nah, why would we learn that? Learnings for dum dums. <laughs> Alright, let's roll. How can I know? What? Yeah, bro, I absolutely would love what you guys done to this server, especially the uh, World War II aspect. Me and over Thanks. Uh, Jesus Christ. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Me and God Silent were just on this uh, yesterday, actually. Yeah, I gotta fix uh, the QRF. So, like, I was hoping nesting M2, like, points are, like, under German control if they would actually stop once we take it. And after server restart to do the actual legit test so I can see better. Nope. So fuck. Well, I'm not... I kind of like, um, I kind of like how they do, uh, kind of spawn back to take the objective. It is a little over excessive how much they do spawn back, but they're they're spawning like right, right on the point though. That's the issue because I had them oh, set to like start at, at like start at the command post and then move off to that position. Oh, okay. So that's the issue. I'm gonna have to like do another system that I have in place. I was hoping that actually nesting it all together that once it's taken it kills. All it like if under German control then spawn this, but it's not. But so I'm still trying to learn how Reforger has all their stuff set up for that, so I'm gonna have to do another um, system and increase be, the time. I can get you in contact with Gramps. Uh, he made the PvE mod. Yeah. I, I have been like looking at how he's done it, but it's like fuck, I'm trying to do something else. But it's yeah, not working. So I think he tried also doing the same thing <laughs> that I'm thinking, but uh, he he what he did. He did. Uh, yeah. He attempted, because uh, I'm part of his admin team, so, um, yeah, no, he tried to do a system where uh, they would QRF. Yeah. So how you do it. Um, it worked, but then he ran into issues where AI would be spawning, similar to you, how they spawn on the command point and then move out. Yeah. Moving from the point where they should be spawning to the command post. Yeah, because they're, they're spawning at their start position. And then I have them troll out, but it's more the issue of it's under our control. They should not be spawning anymore, and it's it. it's not doing it. So, um, and I'm not I'm not familiar with C plus plus at all. I know yeah. not enough, and that's how Reforger is doing it all now. So it's not like Armor Three where it's all HTML, just put it all on Notepad, and you're good to go. So it's definitely a bit of a challenge. I'd probably do the other way where it's like, all right, these guys are set in a two-hour timer. And then they push into attack because generally it's they only spawn in if there's people nearby, and then yeah. they'll start doing their movements. So that's how I did it for Cherno and whatnot. But yeah, they're not doing how I expected. I so I'm gonna have to do the old system. I would say, oh yeah, Gramps and I should work together, but I don't know anything about C plus plus because if we can figure out a way to actually write that in, like do a statement of if point under this control, then spawn group whatever you know and then they'll push in through um, their stuff but i don't know how to write any of that yeah i'll send a dm to um uh, letting you know that you want to talk to him and, uh, i mean shit, um if you're not in the chill fram server I'll, I'll shoot you a discord link too just so you can join it yeah go ahead and do that because i don't know if i am or not yeah because no yeah, that'd that be actually really awesome. cool I do love his PvE remix though. That's what kind of started this whole entire <laughs> snowball effect. <laughs> Originally, it it was, the reason why he created it was because he was getting tired of the PvP kind of staleness at the yeah. time. This was before all the updates and whatnot. So he just wanted to give people like a solo experience that can be done solo, but still be fun in a group. Yeah. And I do really want to fix the uh, AI spawning thing. You know how like if you build a barracks, it would spawn. Last update really fucked that up. Oh, I know. Lucas, but, Lucas. I'm hoping because they're adding in the uh, AI commanding next update confirmed for sure. Yeah. Uh, well, let's hold over here until the attack's done. <laughs> Stuka coming in from a dive. Yeah. Kind of like what they did with RHS with the uh, F-22s and stuff. Yeah. That'd be actually really cool. 
But yeah, hopefully in the next update, because I'm also like future proofing a lot of this. Like, if you build barracks and stuff, then at least you have your AI defending stuff and whatnot as you push out to, for the attack as the players. And if the AI get defeated, then you know you should probably pull back, <laughs> kind of thing. Yeah, for sure. I know for a while Gramps had um, an AI that would like come in from other objectives to take or oh, uh, fight back for an objective that you're taking. Yeah. But I think that broke uh, a couple updates ago. Yeah, that's that's kind of what. So like, so you understand what I have? It's like, uh, let's say this point, for example, you, the guys at Levy would spawn in, and they would by default move in and defend this area. And if that group dies, they're on a timer, and then they respawn back at that point under German control and move back in. So it'd be like a constant yeah. wave attack every 30 minutes or so. Um, but yeah, they're just, they're not doing that. They're, even though it's under US control, they'll respawn and push to what they were doing. So they'll respawn on US control, go back to the back line. I need you two to go back to the truck and pull up the supply truck. But do we have any forces that are at the town outside? No, but we need the supply truck. All right, we'll try so it then. Because we, we'll, we gotta we'll... set up, we wanna set up a respawn here before we hit the town. Okay, sounds good, we'll do that. Uh, if you need to pull it like through the junk, the woods, you can. Copy. Well, actually, I'll, I'll push out a couple people to the road and we'll take the crossroad. Well, there's someone pushing in right now. Yeah, I think we'll be fine. Supply truck on the way in. Came in. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. But yeah, no, um, I'll definitely get you and Gramps in contact because Gramps, uh, he also wants to kind of expand on his uh, game mode. Mm -hmm. Since you're trying to do something that he's kind of stopped trying to do, maybe that'll motivate him to retry it again. Yeah. Because, you know, he, he's pretty well uh, versed in uh, the uh, Reforger coding, so it probably won't be too hard for him. But having help and then probably helping you out would help him out. So yeah. I don't know if that makes any fucking sense. Oh, yeah. And since Gramps kind of like saw me that this is actually possible, I'm like, oh, cool. Time to do the uh, liberation thing. Like I used to do a lot in Armor 3. So uh, let's go. Germans just on the outside of this wall here. Which side? West or northwest? Uh, north. North side of the wall. Uh, probably. We'll push over. It's not a probably, it is a... I can hear them. Oh, I thought you said, I think. Sorry, Major, you gotta talk like a frickin' uh, peon are sometimes to us. Nope, not all of them. Okay. How far are they? In these trees. over there before you push. Yeah, they're in those trees and stuff. Just call him Mega Blocks. Oh my God. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> That's his name. It's now Mega Blocks. There's a MP. Yeah, these guys are all dead. Hearing shots in the west. Yeah, pretty far out. Based on rotation, car 98. Probably just a lone scout. Or a sniper, because I, oh, I hate mm. the triple snipers. Yeah. Got a body here. Oh, I guess uh, somebody from uh, the Overlord's mod team is also working on scopes for the car 98. Mm hmm. I think uh, McTitties is working on that. He does yeah. a lot of the modeling. He loves modeling. <laughs> it all started with his little grease gun, and then it's kind of snowballed. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. Did you just spawn on me? What? Oh, I want to see if this is actually a player. Oh, did... Yeah. Okay, you did spawn on me. So sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. That's all right. slick. Oh, 
Oh yeah, here we go. What else is on this? We're shooting people. Names. What if I kill? Thought I heard some uh, Germans over here. Where do you know Nagova from? I. Don't know. You can spawn in we don't know. I mean, if he drops I mean, the radio. Oh, oh Nagova? It was kind of big in Armor Three, yeah. Hey, uh, turn the Germans all to 50, northeast. It's oh, northeast? Or is that I also spawned on you. The okay, so it's, it sometimes works and sometimes it doesn't. That's Maybe not good. Left and came back, it's working. Uh, Maybe? Left. Well, it also depends on how close you are to the bases, too. Well, we were kind of distant. Oh, okay. And it wasn't, so I don't know. Attacking the front gate. Front gate, Raj. Battle stations. No, it wasn't really that much of a big deal with Nagova. It really wasn't that big. It was just something I kind of liked. I think we have enough that we could probably hit it from two sides. I got one. I don't have a shovel. I got this. Get some guys in that front gate and make sure the Germans aren't pushing. Yeah, I got a. We've also got a uh, our own QRF squad shut up. Here. Oh, oh no! <laughs> hold on, hold on. I think we can get out of here. Yep. Uh, I'm gonna move. I think that we have enough people to attack from two sides. I think so too. We're gonna have uh, one I person think... do direct push from this road and get on the east side while we have another group taking that Is dirt that road on the west. The, uh, yeah. The whole issue and everything, so. yeah. We'll just get uh we're just gonna put the actual real arsenal down until uh the mod team fixes their equipment box. All right. Unless uh he moved it. Oh I actually moved it away over there. Yeah, it looks like it looks like there's some fortifications on the um Uh drive that uh yeah, drive that Jeep around. So there's some fortifications, um Sven. Yeah. Uh to the on the south, on the south, um, southeast corner. Yeah, I see you that. See those two? Yeah. yeah. Those should probably have pretty good view over. If we can get, uh, like a machine gunner up in there, that'll be a good point to cover. Um, and then we'll pull yeah, another same, team on the uh, east side. Road. Yeah. Yeah, and push in from the west. All right, that sounds actually a solid plan. Uh, yeah. let me go get some uh, ammo and stuff, and I'll be right back. Do we have a machine gunner? I, mean, I have a bar. Yeah. Anybody with an actual MG? I'm getting an MG. I can switch into the kit if need be. Alright. So, yeah, okay. I know, we've got Corporal Pickle Rick with the 1911. Or 1919, whatever it is. Yeah, we're up. Absolutely not. Nah. Okay, I just took a quick peek at the enemy forces, and there's a lot of them. Alright. What happened to the Springfield? Was it not in the armor anymore? It's broken. Oh, man. I was part of, I think, a mod that's not working properly. Yeah, it's part of Fortune Europe. Yeah. Oh, wow, we do have a very Okay. Yeah, yeah, you gotta love the fact that they have to use a green side cross side. because the red cross is like, nope, you can't use our logo anymore. Oh, Man. What? Sven? I'm, I'm here, hold on. You're moving like an AI there. <laughs> yeah, I know, because of weird. Okay. Maybe he is an AI. Alright. I think we're all mainly around this area. All right, so we're gonna have two elements push into this town. We're gonna have one element pushing from the east from the main road, and another one pushing up from the dirt road. Um, so, uh, where's I'm gonna, Rick? So I'm gonna be leading uh, one group uh, from the dirt road area. General plan is we need to get our machine gunners and those bunkers on the east and the west side so we can maintain pressure on uh, Levy itself. 
while the infantry moves in with smokes and uh, try to get into those houses and stuff. So we need to kind of divvy up uh, two teams. So uh, all I need is I'm gonna need a machine gunner, either a bar or someone with a fucking 30, doesn't matter. Probably. Yeah, that works. Um, Mumu will be with me, followed by the medic, uh, sugar daddies, dabs. Whoops. Um, yeah, that wasn't an accidental slip. Up. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Megabyte, you'll be with me, and uh, Soul. Um, uh, they're probably gonna have more defenses on the main road side, so more forces going up that main road would probably be best. It should all be pretty flat, so we shouldn't really be fighting uphill at all. Hopefully. Um, but, yeah. yeah. I took a peek down the main road, and it was mostly downhill, and you can see directly into their tent. Okay, yeah, perfect. The, the fortifications at, um, like, 0.75046, those ones should have a pretty nice view down. There's two bunkers, it looks like, there, so... Those will be a really good position for the machine guns. All right. Um, Johnny, you lead your element to the main road? Yeah. If I called your name from before, uh, come with me, we're gonna move in on foot. Actually, uh, we'll have the captain, uh, we'll have the captain take that, uh, element. What I got? Fire team? <laughs> uh, oh, then Megabyte, I over here on me. I don't remember if I got my name oh, oh, What the hell? Oh, he desert! Forgot his, he forgot his parachute again. God damn it, desert. All right. Uh... Since my team has a little bit more of a little bit of a run, we're going to go ahead and push in. We're going to kind of set up on the edge of uh, 072045 so until your so element's good. Uh, All right. Uh, we're going to step off in 30 seconds. Element. Check your equipment. Make sure you guys got everything you need. I do not have a radio. I'll be relaying my commands and I'll have through Sven Martin. Oh, well. Apparently, I've been scared of moving. Unless you want to command well, if you an got element, shot, then Sergeant. Yeah. Or what? Do you want to command an element, Sergeant? No, thank you. I'm not a commander. You are, sir. I am bringing I more bullets. More bullets, the better. I'm more of a shoot than some I have 30 kind mags. I think that's I enough. Phobia. That's more than enough. I grab extra mags for my action 11. Make sure dude, you got uh, dude, plenty dude. of ammo. We're not too far from here. Um, if we do need reinforcements, we'll be good. I'm ready. All right, my team, let's go. Riggs, whenever you're ready to roll out, roll out. What are you asking me to do, man? You're, uh... I got like 20 things <laughs> Germans. We've been killing Germans. Fuck We're them sauerkrauts. Fuck them sauerkrauts. <laughs> Fucking kidding me? Sneak up on us. Ew, my esters. Well, we are a bit away from where we're hit. Hopefully they didn't hear that. No, I'm sure they did. Oh, we'll just keep on moving. All right, my team's almost in position uh, for the attack. Give us the green light once your team is uh, ready. Over. Mushrooms. I need some morphine. Oh yeah. 
How much do you need? Morphine list. <laughs> That's a good shit. You need morphine? Okay, hold still. No, 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 no I'm good now. I'm good now. Oh. <laughs> I want to see if you can morphine bomb someone in this game. Sure you can. <laughs> no, um, Ace Medical is supposed to add something like that where you can overdose. Fuck yeah. I'm just waiting for him to kind of more refine it. Because it's basically turning it into a knockdown simulator. And even still, yeah. you get shot in the head and you're dead. So it's like, mm, I don't really want my player base to be dealing with that. Armor yeah, 3, so without Ace Medical, you die instantly. <laughs> you yeah, needed Ace Medical. True. Now with this, it's like, ah. <laughs> no matter what, it's just knockdown simulator. Okay. Does that either yeah, die instantly or knockdown instantly? Hmm. I was unconned for 15 minutes once after getting all medical care. Yeah. IV bags, epinephrine, morphine, bandages, all of it. I was still out. I all right, they're pushing the in. Let's go. So do they not like, can they not like copy the same system? No, so not from Armor 3. Um, so they have Armor 3's base, but they don't have the exact coding. It's been modified for Reporter. But it's, it's nothing like the actual ace system for me. Shit, I think this trench line's clear. I hope it is. Yeah. So kind of like a revive script saying you're dead to revive? No, it's more like you have to actually get medication and stuff for ace uh, medical. And even then you're still knocked out. It was kind of to do like if you got shot in the chest and would have like killed you, you no, instead you would be knocked no. out kind of thing. Yeah, this is all clear. All right. So this is an overwatch in the city. We're going to push more to the northeast and try to get more set up. Actually, right in this farm here. Oh, actually, never mind. Fuck all that. Push over this way. We're going to hit the northeast. We're going to stay on the direct west side and cover the road. I'm going to this wall. Roger. We've taken their command post. Build more pylons. The house right here. How many we got in the road? I see one behind a tree directly ahead. All right, let's get those 30s out in bars. And let's get that shit set up in the road. Oh, Do it now. Here. Get set up. I don't see us yet. They do now. All right, let's go, go, go. Uh, yeah, there you go. Now you're set up. Contact left side of the road. I'm gonna get a trench up on the left side, then I want the machine gunner to move and uh, get in position. Although you can set up a bipod or something on top of this. Trench set. Push back to the street. Uh, machine gunner, yeah. I want you on the street as well with me. Everyone else keep pushing. Megabyte, you're a point man. Okay, watch right side when you come yep, yep, yep. 
shit, why'd you move back? Oh, fuck. God damn it, <laughs> God damn it. Fuck it, I'm grabbing his MG. Grab his MG, I'm pulling back. It was too late for me to kind of be like, stop shooting too. He just moved back in. Oh my God. Hey, Vesper, how you doing, brother? Context down the road for me. Everyone's got a bar. Run to me now. Get set up here and start shooting down where that smoke is. Oh, night shift office. Ah, uh, I know that feeling. I know that feeling so hard. God damn, man. Friendlies are front. Just know that you're here in spirit. They are currently working on animations and uh, getting a lot of that done. But animations and stuff take a long time to reforger, honestly. It's a lot of work. That is the 30, that's a 34, I think. Or is that a stinger? I'm not sure. Is that one down? Uh, he is now. Friendly's on the right. Uh, yeah, German's north side. Since our friendly's are over there coming the road, let's push over to the north. Get in this fucking trench line over here with this bunkers and shit. Hey, give me a machine gunner facing this way towards the north at the end of this trench line. Give me another one facing direct east as well. Overwatching the field. Jesus fucking Christ. Raj, it's coming up the road, probably west side. Raj. Dear Lordy. It's done in a uh, blender, and then from there, you put it into Reforger, and then you start doing some more fine tuning after that. I'm gonna watch north. Because whatever you do in Blender isn't going to be 100% perfect, and then once you get it up in Reforger, it's a lot of uh, fine-tuning and stuff. But even then with Blender, it is uh, a bunch of work on top of it. Okay, just in case that ha doesn't happen again. Sol, I want you to cover the West Road. Uh, we still got someone over there, which is fantastic. Our guys down the road just got wiped. Did they? Oh yeah, shit. Give me a guy with a bar over here. Get behind this trench and then lay down the fucking hate. Hi, right, Jerry. I kind of need your rifle. I ran out of ammo. Thank you. Come 
Stuka! Stuka, get in cover! <laughs> go, 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 go! There is one I added in. I'm good, I'm good. There was one I added in, but like, on the editor side, it all worked, but then I went on the server, it didn't, which actually I was kind of sad about. But yeah, I wish there was definitely bigger backpacks. I think it's just gonna come to the case where we're using teamwork, honestly. More Jerry's East. Ah, yes, reloading the car. Who's on 32? Uh, my team is. Oh yeah, this is so tricky without seeing the animation, the animation of the uh, bolt. It's so tricky. Oh my god, I keep missing. God damn it, Soul got fucking KIA. I don't have anything to really help you with, but. Sound good over there? I'm grabbing his uh, 30. There might be some more on the tent. Killed one. Oh, fuck, that's a lot of bodies. Friendlies? Copy, got you. North side! I'm okay. Holy shit. Can we get someone watching the north from this bunker down here? North, north, north. Soul, I don't know if I have any room to grab your other box, but I'm gonna fucking try here. No, I don't. Fuck. I'm watching the north right now because they're coming through the wood line. Roger. Never mind that. The bipod isn't working. Yeah, I respawned on the wrong team. I'm gonna run to you guys. Raj.
Victory. Whole squad uh, east. Squash into the left right. Oh, Things on the side ammo. Let me see what one of these guys have. He killed Mumu again. Oh my god. Poor Mumu's just getting fucking trashed on today, man. How many rounds you got, German? Six? That'll do. Ooh! There's a 42 or 30, whatever. Oh, I didn't do a PMI. Oh my God. Soul! Duty, motherfucker. Where are you? I got you. I'm gonna carry you. Oh, oh, no, 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 uh, once the animation update uh, comes out, that's gonna be good. They never built a fucking radio. They didn't build a fucking radio. Oh my god, they built everything else but not a radio. Oh my god. Oh, I know. But when you can't, he when you can only hear it and not see it, it's like, ah, uh, I don't know. But yeah, if it's circular, it's 34. If it's square, it's 42. Let me see. Who can I spawn on? I can spawn on Chris. Hi. Uh, okay, it wasn't your back. I thought you actually deployed one itself. No, no, no. This is just to show that I'm a uh, paper booker man. <laughs> <laughs> pencil pusher, pencil pusher. But don't they both have the relatively same fire rate or no? Cause I'm pretty sure they're both still a buzzsaw and scary. Fire from the north. Yeah, artillery, artillery. IDF, IDF! Explosive artillery. Swamp in the backyard. Yeah. Just need some hard fucking cover for now. We can inside something or get it down. Let's see if I can do something funny here. Yeah, they're right on the outside. I can't really see through these uh, planks. They're swinging around to this There's someone talking to the north. Raj, I'm gonna open. To the north. It's all smoke. There's a whole bunch. I wish I had room for fucking frags. Yeah, throw it over to that smoke. A little past it, too. I threw a little too far. We'll see. Nope, we're on the money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was good. Yeah, they're hopping the fences right now over on our east side. Here, I'll have a grenade right in that corner. Oh, fuck. That actually destroyed the fence. Yeah, that's still really high. Oh, they're in those trees right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Oh, you destroyed the fence. Good. Yeah, there they are. They're running. If you got another nade, throw it back over there. Oh, I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. Damn. All right. Freeze. Smoke's clearing up. Shit. Backside. Yeah, they're starting to uh, move around. Clear out this way. Raj. I'm seeing uh, a couple of friendlies on our east. Did they run past us and they didn't... Oh, shit. Yeah, I hear it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, a sneaky little bastard. Sneaky bastard. Should be dead now. Hello. Oh, hello, Saul. I pinged you, game master. We're getting more ammo. Oh, yeah, north, north, but I like my Garan. I, I just like the iron sights. I can see a lot more. Have more uh, peripherals. Raj, Raj. All right, pushing back in the north. Yeah. Careful, there's friendlies. Uh, Push we're kind of throwing. Oh shit! Over to my side, west side, west side. They're pushing on the west bunker now, they're getting into the road. Push him back to that bunker. No ping yet. Alright, look, it's just a knockoff, okay? It's a Chinese made Garan. What's up, Dante? How is Star Citizen, bro? Go on an adventure, child soldier. You've been playing uh, that a lot. How is it? It's a diet. Garan. Aw, oh, smile. I'm a space shuttle door gunner. I, I've been seeing a couple of it. I'm not going to lie. Looks like fun, man. You make, you make me want to get games. I'm just like, man, I kind of want to get that now. Too busy. Too busy. I keep getting distracted on stuff. Like right now, I'm distracted on uh, single player Tarkov a little too much. I can't wait to reinforce the fight. Oh, that that pretty much clear ah, yes. Does that make things fun? You're right. I'm sure Just like how Resident Evil 6 was fucking so hilarious yesterday. I had a lot of fun with that, honestly. I thought I wasn't. I thought I wasn't going to have fun, but I actually had fun with it. Friendly's in the bunker to the left. I see him. Wilbert! What do you see, Wilbert? Nothing. You're not Wilbert! Oh, Got, eh. Eh. Let me on! Alright. Wait, you know what? I forgot to log in. There we go. Smile. Dude, every time you and Liru start playing, I have something going on, and I'm really sad about it. I'm like, damn it, you guys are doing it. Fuck. I'm gonna push up that north fence soon to clear what I can. Raj. 
these guys had MG 42s. There was one over here in the salt. It was just before dawn, one miserable morning, I'm black 44. Board commander was told to sit tight. So there's one on me in this, uh... Contacts west. I'll just do what Lear does and just mass call everyone. <laughs> it, it was just out west, like uh, southwest, like coming up the MSR area or the field of. Copy. There we go. I got eyes on. How's it going, boys? Direct west of the fucking Jeep. Hey, does anyone got a bar? Hey. Get someone in this fucking bunker, you have a good sight line. Megabyte! Get in, get in that window. See if I can. Hopefully you can set up and uh... Yeah, we're, we're doing alright, Major. There's a promotion in this one for you. Oh boy! I'm coming back with a toy. Roger that. All right, good night, Chris. Sleep that. well, brother. I need some, uh, I need to pull off some infantry to hold the, uh, east side a little bit. We had a lot coming in right up on the point. Raj? I don't have radio. Hey, we need some guys over on the east side, uh, from the other attack more group. Planes, planes. My side, uh, Stuka, Stuka. my element will keep holding the west. Get take cover. Stuka. No, we're not. Major, only quitters say that. Stop fucking hearing bells. <laughs> Although right now my favorite weapon in Tarkov is the P90. I, think they're all dead over there. Oh, yeah. I have actually killed Killa yeah, multiple yeah, times just being like, <laughs> and like, haha, I win. So, no such a fun gun. I didn't realize how fun the P90 is, but man, that ammo's expensive. Hey, we got a Jerry out in the west side. And he's dead. What Jerry? Ha <laughs> <Okay>. funny. <laughs> got him. That was, a, that was another shot. Where'd it come from? Uh, it seems like, like, like more direct 320, west. 320, 320. Get back up in that bunker. You gonna set up uh, in this town for some... Uh, well, if we can get supplies up over here. Also, we never set up our radio tower at Polk, so we're not getting any supplies over there. Oh, that's good. Yeah, um, you guys built everything but a radio tower. I didn't actually build it. I think it west. was uh, rigs. So, there you go. Um, Take shots from the west. Yeah, if I die, I'll bring supplies to Polk and then uh, some yeah. here. West, south, west. Then, well, we have 500 here. I'm going to run back and get a radio tower. 260, 260. On the fence, on the fence. No, the lighting really is, and it's something that Bohemia has kind of like said that they're trying to work on. But Still hopefully it's not an engine limitation. They're like, oh, we know, we're we're trying to fix it. And it's like, oh uh, man, I hope you guys do, because dear lord, hey Elvin! The Major's dead, we lost the Major. Put 
this. I need to put on the build anywhere mod, to be honest. Still 320. Yeah, I'm really hoping that it's not just a huge engine limitation. There it is. Right to left. I was going to say, isn't it late for you? I, I was going to get off the line. Uh, I think I'm going to call it quits for here. Uh, uh see you around, guys. Uh, good one. Take it easy. Alright, have a good, good one. Work, uh, clearing the town? Good uh, job. as they would say, hoorah. Good job. Uh, uh staff sergeant. <gasps> I've been promoted to staff sergeant. Oh, boy. Alright, I need, I need to bring the supplies to Polk. All right, keep holding here. I need to bring uh, some of the supplies to Polk so we can get that radio tower up. Yeah, once they do, I mean, definitely. And then that's gonna be one thing I'm gonna see if I can possibly do is like set up uh, like patrols with vehicles through the editor and stuff to kind of make things a bit more interesting. But however, if my QRF idea isn't going to work, then doing that is going to make things a little bit more challenging on top of it. But at least it'll be easier for the uh, game masters and stuff to have some German, fun with it. Close, tree line. Like a part of me is like, I'm surprised it's taking them so long to figure this out. But then, then again, uh, when it comes to Daisy, yeah, there's more than one. They didn't really figure out a way to kind of fix all that. Yeah, so those the, yeah, those QRF guys just right. respond right there when they uh, shouldn't. So. I'm definitely gonna have to fix all that. I'm probably gonna have to do an old school uh, system tactic or something like that. I tell you, Riggs did it. <laughs> I, I tell you, Riggs actually uh, did it. Okay. No, no. En engine building is not an easy task at all. Absolutely not. It's very, very challenging. But like I was saying, like, so the Daisy engine doesn't really have anything in place for like AI movement or stuff like that, for example. For instance, what they have is uh, like a patrol thing. So when the zombies spawn, they spawn, but they patrol. And when they get aggro, they follow the aggression. Just like how what I'm noticing the units here is what they do. When they get aggressed or like they notice something, they go and investigate and then they start shooting if they identify that it's the enemy. But as far as in, like vehicles and stuff like that, it's definitely been a huge challenging for them to get that actually properly coded in and working with the engine and stuff. I mean, I remember a year ago, I'm like, why don't they just make Arma 4? Why are they doing Reforger? I don't get it. But now kind of like as development moves along, it kind of makes sense that, yeah, they built a new engine and they want to try to get everything actually working. If they just released Arma 4, like this, it would definitely be a very, very challenging and shit. Who is shooting at me? Did you guys just shoot at me? Yes, that's my bad. God damn it. <laughs> sorry, sorry, my bad. Oh shit, enemies in the area. Yeah, there was one down the road. On the road, actually. Oh, you mean down over here? Like in that, in that 
barn. They were coming from the east, so. They're also coming from the north, so. Jeep from the west over to the tent. What's this over here? Because I don't have a battle buddy, some German's gonna pop out of nowhere and just like, you know, shoot me. There's like a Japanese mod or something like that for World War II. Oh boy. Put on uh, the knife mod and stuff, give them katanas. Or you know what, a bunch of Japanese guys are going to come out of the tree line doing a bonsai charge. But I still remember when they did Reforger, though. They were like, all right, Reforger's only going to be around for a year, and then we're going to release Arma 4, you know, blah, blah, blah. And it's like, yeah, it's still going on. There's so much that they got to do to fix a lot of shit. I also think, too, it's part of their original code. They're coming from the southwest. They probably didn't properly, uh, did things correctly. Because I know some of the old Armor 3 developers Bohemia had retired or went off to different projects and stuff. So, I know that's been, like, a huge... A huge issue for them. There's a few over here. I know one of their better devs, like, passed away, Mr. Bushman. Uh, contact south. Contact south somewhere, took a shot from the tree line. No idea from where. What the fuck? You're also here too. Oh shit. Fuck no bang. Nice shot. Right through the engine block. Alright, I'm gonna move back to the uh, military base, see what the hell's going on over there. Copy. I'll keep holding this. Yeah, I mean, shit. Armor 3 has been around since what? 2011? 2010? It's definitely uh, a very dated game and a very dated engine. That wasn't really designed properly for future proofing. Um, cause you know, back in the day when it was out, I mean, it still ran okay. Everyone was kind of used to being like, oh yeah, 30 FPS, that's perfectly fine for games and stuff. That's not a problem. But as time's going on, it's like, yeah, Arma 3 is uh, definitely major struggling. But the main reason why I'm really focusing on Reforger though is because Armor 4 is gonna be using the Reforger engine and it, all compatibilities. So everything you learn in the editor and stuff from Reforger is gonna work in Armor 4. So, learning it, getting it used to it, and then when Armor 4 drops, boom, immediately start working and stuff. Plus, even all the mods, too. All the mods in Armor Forger are going to work for Armor 4. So, that's why you're seeing a bigger mod scene hitting Reforger now when Bohemia released that information. So, now people are like, fuck it. Yeah, let's do it. If uh, Armor 4 is going to be using Reforger to a T, then, yeah, we might as well start working on mods and stuff, because then whatever we're doing in Reforger can work for Armor 4. So that's why you got RHS uh, putting more attention on Reforger. That's why you got a bunch of these other guys. You got uh, the Ace team working on that too, just recently. And then you got me, who's like, ah, let's bring in the PVE element, which I hope that they do add a little bit more to the editor uh, to make things just a little bit easier for understanding. But even still, if you learn how to do more of the complex stuff, it should make things a little bit easier. What the hell's going on over here? 
Johnny! What the fuck is that name, Johnny? Uh, so can you hear us? Yes. How's it going over there? Uh, German squad, uh, pushed in. Uh, the base defenders are holding them off, though, as best they can. Uh, they should have this under control. Okay. Yeah, there's no one, uh, attacking the other place, the town. Go ahead and start building an arsenal and start loading up on, uh, ammo and shit. We can't. There's still enemies in the area, but we can't find any enemies. Okay, I arrived. Stop copy. Wide 60? More like 180. <laughs> if you if you tab out or anything, I've noticed this too while watching my friends stream and stuff. If you tab out, it will automatically go down to the lowest resolution and then for a little bit it'll pop back up when you tab back over. Although the last AI update was fantastic. I do love the fact that the AI have a little bit more uh, autonomy behind it. Which is definitely really nice. Sometimes. Shit. Hey, stay right there, German. Okay, thank you. Thank you for not having situational awareness. Now I blew up your balls. Yeah, we're clear. Clear at the military base. Clear at the military base. I'm going to start loading up with supplies and uh, meet you guys over there. We're gonna head up to, uh, break. We're gonna head up to Pulaski, Lawrence. Actually, can I load up, uh... West, if you guys want to build that real quick. Yeah, Six, engage him. You're doing a great work, Six. Living quarters and barracks, but right now that's broken. It's uh, been broken since last update. Got it. Where the hell do you place this thing? Uh, if you go All right, let's just load up that much. Check engine? No. I can't see what you're seeing. Uh, hold on. Let me get out of here. It should be right over here. That's the parking brake. Oh, wait. Is it already placed? Okay, Vess. Ah, okay. Yeah, this is a spot right now. Supposedly. What? Yeah. In the area. Where? 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 I just heard a shot. Where was he? He's right there. Yeah, he's right there. Yeah, there you guys go. Fucking bitch. Get out of here. <laughs> I'm walking here. Still enemies. Wait, there we go. We're getting down the arsenal. You put it all the way over? No, the radio tower's He's still dead. up. It's good. Yeah, we already got a radio up. It just said arsenal. Does it still say there's enemies or not? It's fine. I can build. <laughs> you sound so defeated. <laughs> Arsenal's up by the flag. Make sure you move it a little bit so we can build. It's a bug with uh, modded uh, stuff. Just, Try uh... Got it. Got it. 
Yeah, there it is. Am I about to get stuck? I bet I am. Nah, you'll be fine. Enemy has been spotted oh, in the area. These oh, fucking where? Germans. I bet he's coming from the west. I can bet on it. I bet you. How much was five cents back in the day? Pretty much a lot. They can give you like ten burgers. Five cents. I bet you my Thompson magazine that I can find it anywhere else. Man, I rem I wish you could go back to the days where McDonald's was like a buck fifty for a burger and fries. Oh man, the good old days. Oh shit, oh, shit. he's over there. We were all wrong. Pushing it from Lawrence, I swear to God. Oh, here in the north. North, north, east. I did say the Reforger in a hole plays a lot better than Armor 3. But I can understand people like, uh, for instance, Liru, um and other like primary uh, Zeus players will have a big hard time with it. That's one thing I don't understand why they kind of like cut back on the whole entire uh, Zeus aspect of it all uh, when you build your missions and stuff. It definitely makes it a bit more challenging. I just don't wholeheartedly why they decided to cut a lot of those features and alienate those uh, those individuals. Northeast, Raj. Oh, it doesn't have a fucking pulled back animation. It's just the bolt is yeah. permanently closed. Uh, I'll go back to the days course. you can get a cheeseburger and fries and coke and get a quarter back. Man, those were the days, brother. I'm gonna go back to the days where even the manager said the customer's always right because I got so many catfish dinners at McDonald's for free. All right, let's push off to Lawrence before the next QRF comes in. Let's hit them before they get here. Sounds good. All right, load up, rock cock. Let's go. Hit them before they attack us again. What did he say? You heard me, private. Is he in the command? Is there ammo in this truck? Um, yeah. But you gotta remember, Bohemia also does NATO contracts and stuff like that for the US military and NATO as a whole for training. So you got two different departments and, um, you can't just easily pull someone from that team to civilian or civilian to that team because uh, all those developers too need to actually have a certain kind of security clearances on top of it. So they're probably getting outside help and uh, like oh, that might be a better one. something yeah. else. But I prefer those other ones, but yeah, there's no way to do that. All right, whoever's in here, go on to the other one over here. Does that one have ammo? Uh, this yeah. one doesn't. This has wait, some wait. supplies in the back. I just grabbed this, loaded up, and went. Uh, but we can definitely load them up with ammo from the boxes here. Should I unload I mean, this one? Like in the back here? No, 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 no. I'm bringing this to Lawrence. This is going to be oh, the uh, okay, okay. the set piece. But I am going to get some uh, M2 ammo in here, and that's it. Bada ping, bada boom. Actually, I'm going to be kind of smart, too. Where's my Thompson ammo? There it is. Good thing Thompson ammo's free, baby. Customer is always right, isn't the full phrase? Apparently, it's the customer is always right in a matter of taste. Yeah, but here in America, uh, we don't give a shit about the full, uh, full speaking line. Smile. We're just okay. saying fuck it. The passenger or the gunner? <laughs> I didn't even see the option. <laughs> you gotta look more up, but it's funny. Okay, uh, yeah, I can get it. Okay, yeah, there you go. Turn all the way around now. All right. Move. Uh, you can go. You can go ahead and piss in the uh, fucking uh, gas tank there. 
It's all diesel engines. I'm sure that's how it works. This thing does not shift. Now you have to manually do it. What's the full saying? Jack Paul Trace, master of none, a failure, and something. I forgot what the whole line is. Same thing for uh, blood is thicker than water, or something like that. The blood of the covenant is thicker than water, however. I always forget what the full sayings are for a lot of things, but as an American, uh, I can get away with it. Because fuck it. Oh, that's fucking lovely. What was that? Artillery. Oh, shit. I don't know if it's directed. Yeah, it's directed on us. There's how there's housing over to the northwest. Yeah, I see it. There's a guardrail in the way. Fuck. Five ACP failed me. I have failed my family. I thought I was being smart. Turns out I wasn't. Now some German's gonna get in that fucking 50 on that gun. Aw, oh, damn it. I should have stuck with the plan. I should have stuck with the battle plan. I, uh, I hesitated. And thus I got absolutely fucking clapped. Fence really fucking did. At least I hit the I, at least I hit the machine gunner. We're just gonna go in on foot. We're gonna be a good good boy and not use uh vehicle resources. Like an old World War II style. I got my uh shoe brewers on. My feet Sadies. What do I do? I don't need to take the road. I can go wherever I want. You know what game I'm waiting to get updated more? Fucking Mana Lords, dude. Good game. Just gonna let that cook and bake for a lot longer. That's a fun little game. Do 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 You guys still doing good over there? Don't die in me, son. Flash bleed. We're gonna lose him. Everybody's gonna die. Where am I at? So they push over to the house that I was pushing in. Oh god, we gotta move. We gotta move. Hello, 
people, Mr. Pickle. There's a lot of them, David MG. Oh, yeah. Don't worry, just speak sweet nothings in their ear. Germans love sweet nothings. Oh, we lost him. I don't think he spoke sweet nothings fast enough. Hey, Doc, have you looked into doing Fika? Bad German, don't throw that grenade. Wow, that's a lot of fucking Germans right there. I'd recommend that. We've been playing it with uh, Chris one time, and it was a lot more stable. But I know Liru does not like Hamachi, and he didn't trust SBT. Then again, I don't like Hamachi either, but... Time to set up then sit, as it doesn't have a launcher for installing. Yeah. That... That is true. Maybe that was, uh... On the road up there. Maybe that's what it... Yeah, because I just woke up one day and I saw that, like, they're all playing together and stuff. I was like, oh, damn. Fuck. Yeah, but the connection was a lot more stable uh, through it, but I don't know if it's just a machi thing. Fuck you. One got him. No, you don't. For Fika? Whew. At least that's how we were able to do it with, uh, with Chris. Chris set up, a uh, Hamachi. It's just port forwarding. Why did why did Chris do fucking Hamachi? I mean, you also have port forwarding, but also uh, the there's a contact right it's behind that hedge. Sense. I hear him, so I'm trying to look for. Fuck it. Yeah, throw a grenade. I don't have any grenades. This radio pack has no grenade space. Out. So sad. Damn. I eat butterflies. I eat butterflies are hilarious. Oh, oh, I'm in the tree. Oh, how did I do this? Uh, I'm a sniper uh, now. Magic man, magic man. <laughs> there, there I'm Christ. climbing on the edges. Ah! Oh, hi, German. And now you're dead. You had no situation awareness. Yeah, I hear him. My brothers died up here. Brothers in arms, hell highway. I did it! I beat him! Can't wait for bayonets to be a thing. <laughs> are they adding that? I think they are, right? Yeah, they're going to. This next update. And then this team's gonna have their own bayonets. There were a lot of Germans here. There was a part. You have no okay. access to port forwarding. Your router isn't. It's recommended. Oh, okay. maybe that's why. Maybe that's why Chris is using Kamachi then. Oh, there's a German truck out here too. Or is that my truck that I drove up? Uh, I don't Talk about the one with the engine on. Yeah. 
Yeah, that, that's when I drove up and uh, when I was freaking out because of the borders and shit. Yeah. I'm gonna pull this over to the road. Keep the change, you filthy animal. All right, can I switch back to the driver from here? No. Oh, 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 my FPS. Oh. There we go. It's good. Oh, hey, Pickle Rick. Welcome back. Oh, they're coming down the road. Oh, Northwest, Northwest, 380. 330, sorry. 380? That's not something I can do. The only thing that's pushing is straight one for Ha, huh, cornhole. I love cornhole. Ow. Grenade out. Grenade out. Fuck you. Ugh. Ha, parkour. Down the road. I got like three shots left, Germans. Come here. Raj. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, more Germans. They have a little bunker up the hill. My God, they do. They're definitely using the RGD5 animation for that. Is that one of them? I threw a grenade, yes. Okay. Hi, German. Oh, he got back up on the roof. Take a potato masher! Oh shit. I'm throwing a nade over. Okay. Yeah, there's a bunch at that fucking uh at the hedge. Like right where I'm aiming. Hello, sir? Down the road. Right. Might have gotten a few. Oh, really not in front. Down. Good kill. Good kill. Might be dead. Oh, damn it. I was hoping to get a collateral. Oh. Oh. No. He did 6969. I know he did 6969. I don't know if he set up by 25565, though. I wouldn't know the uh, full details on that, uh, on that portion. I might increase, uh, since it's more PvE, I might find a way to set up the increase of uh, how much uh, supplies get added in. Or uh, regenerating once you get the flag down. I'm going to have to go through the stuff there and see if I can actually do that. I don't know if it's per point or if it's all together. 
If it's all together, that'll make my life so much easier, but if it's per point, that's gonna be a little time consuming. Just a little bit. Yeah. He also changed a few things. I, I don't know exactly what Chris did or how long it took him. I just know I woke up one day and then Wolf, Chris, and uh, Squiggly were all playing together. And I'm like, oh. And the client side mods were working that you use for SPT. So, like, my FOV fix uh, one where I can, like, zoom in like this, like an Armor 3, was working. Which was great. Very, very nice. Same requesting bots. I don't know if Chris actually added that one in or not. Hey, for all my European viewers, I got a question. Your guys' beehives, do you guys actually, like... Day that gray zone is in. I don't know, just graphically, it just meh, looks bad. But, anyways, I will see you guys later. F. Wow. Big sad. I know. But anyways, I'll see you guys later. Take it easy. Have a wonderful day. Bye bye.